computer simulation at auto parts supplier Continental. Before a tire can be used on a test run, its braking performance is checked by the computer. The high-tech company invests more than 800 million euros per year in research and development. If you take a closer look at Continental, it soon becomes clear that there's far more to the company than tires. Conti is a giant in a booming business sector, a supplier to the car industry with heaps of know-how. Expert Andreas Bremer sees Continental as an ideal addition to the Scheffler Group. Conti is certainly perceived as a high-tech company, and without wanting to sound negative, Scheffler is the classic mechanic with oily fingers. The group is entering new terrain, a lot more shiny, if you like, in the high-tech sector, and there are opportunities Scheffler simply didn't have up until now. The new alliance means Conti isn't the only new member of the Scheffler Group. For example, it will also be joined by SAS from Zwickau. Conti now owns 50% of the company. Here, 300 SAS workers are constructing entire cockpits with air conditioning, airbag and electronics for VW cars. When VW asks for modifications, the supplier has to be able to come up with some quick answers. We complete some 1,250 cars a day. The vehicle cockpits themselves aren't standards. They're tailored to meet individual orders. Made to measure and ready for installation in the actual vehicle just 90 minutes later. The VW factory in Mosul is just four kilometers away. It's added value for the customer. He doesn't have to worry about 120 different suppliers. We deliver a complete and finished module. And we're responsible for quality control. The client can use the production space he'd normally need for cockpits for something else. And he needs less staff and other resources. SAS delivers not only cockpits, but ideas too, and invests large sums of money in product development. No manufacturer can survive without innovative suppliers. The suppliers can establish closer links to the manufacturers. The two sides depend on each other, where in the past there was a one-sided dependency. The headlines for the new Cadillac come from Lippstadt in North Rhine-Westphalia. Hella has long been a global player selling its state-of-the-art lighting technology to manufacturers worldwide. The company's latest development? High-tech headlights with LED technology. Small diodes provide a warmer lighting effect designed to improve visibility. When you consider what qualities a company expects from its employees nowadays, they certainly differ from those back in the 1950s and 60s. Back then a headlight was basically just a tin reflector and a glass covering. Nowadays you need to know about software and electronics in order to develop such complex systems. Expertise and design that has cost Hella a pretty penny. No one will say exactly how much money is involved, but one thing is certain. The new LED headlights were over two years in the making.